Welcome to my first uh, AM transmitter kit I'm gonna build. It's the Ramsdy AM AM1C, and like you're gonna see, is uh, this is the package with the manual, the building kit. The other part and the part you're gonna put the tools on. These are the bags with the equipment you have to put on the board. And that's the manual. And I've also already uh, printed it from uh, the internet, the manual. Right, take two. Well, we are uh, now at the first break of uh, making this uh, Ramsey transmitter. We've put on the power button, it's here. The audio input, the power RF output, the 12 volt input is the power output to the antenna we've installed the tuning device we've installed the oscillator device it's over here it's not completed at all uh, on this moment because we have to put on later on there three parts for choosing the frequency we want to broadcast on and also I We'll turn later back to you with more about this very nice transmitter. Alright, just uh, finished uh, the part of the modulation. The uh, modulation uh, is uh, adjust here on the outside of the box later on. And this part is the part who are useful for the modulation. You can see if you look bright enough you can see here is a part where you can put on this same as this for a mic. I'm gonna put it on later and now we're gonna start with the last part of the transmitter and that will be over here uh, it will be the power fetch for the 100 uh, milliwatts and also this part you can see here where you can adjust uh, the frequency before you can uh, tune in with this thing All right. so we're going further with the transmitter All right it's almost ready for use here is the back side. Flip over to the front. Yeah. Looks very nice. So the operating system is almost ready for use. Once again I'll let you show the inside if we get a clear picture, yes. Um, parts I have um, some parts which I have put uh, in an other way than the manual. The two lost two transistors the Q4 and the Q3 are higher because I maybe want to replace them with the 2N2219 transistor for more power also 
on this side the this part is higher because it's for the mic to put the mic gain on a higher level maybe I get uh, not a good sound around it so I want to uh, replace or remove it later so that's higher also I hope to get into it yes you can see it okay this and this part are higher because I may replace them with the different or another frequency so there is a beautiful uh, Ramsty AM1 transmitter almost I say almost available on the air which we're going to try a little bit later on and I will give you more about the Ramsey transmitter later so I hope you enjoy this little view we come back to you later thank you I have a well welcome back to the first uh, broadcast small test broadcast of the Rams the AM1 like you see I have a little test face put here in first use I want to use the 1602 as frequency for my broadcasts but it was not as quite as good frequency I thought so I already changed on this part like I told you some things it's uh, written in the manual and so the transmitter could work on another frequency also the tuning device of the frequency this one is turned to to the other frequency and this is also the problem with this transmitter is this part is very sensitive so if you're going to choose a frequency uh, stay on this frequency don't uh, start uh, tuning up down every day in other frequency because uh, it's very sensitive and it could be uh, going yeah, broken or not good functioning so be careful with this uh, for all the viewers from uh, this broadcast Molation is on Modulation is now high, still no overmodulation. Right, we are uh, we are back on the testing of the AM1, the Ramsty transmitter. Um, you can see on this moment the transmitter is uh, put on um, power meter. Uh, I put on a little antenna which is uh, over here it's still on a little uh, cable for this uh, experiment and we're checking the power on this moment and I hope you can tune in to it's 200 milliwatts which is uh, contained from these little two original transistors so later on this project we're gonna power up we're gonna remove those two like I said before and we're gonna look uh, what the power will be on that moment now starting this transmission this test transmission <coughs> the power was uh, 150 milliwatts 
it went uh, very soon higher to 200 milliwatts. So the transmitter is giving on this moment 200 milliwatts on the MIDI wave frequency. And uh, I'm going to build in the 2N2219. And I hope hopefully we get uh, a little bit more power of this uh, very nice kit. Okay. Uh, just a uh, little close up of the two transistors I uh, have uh, replaced. I hope you can see it. It's uh, I have a little bit space between it. The last one is uh, also cooled. So there's a better view. Last one is also cooled, as you can see. So here we have it, the new upgraded transmitter. And it will be approximately uh, around uh, 200 milliwatts. And I tested it also on uh, the dummy and it stands uh, on 100 milliwatts 100 milliwatts plus so it's possible it's easy and you have a little bit more power maybe you just received a street or two more with this nice transmitter so that's it for now I hope you enjoyed uh, watching the video. Alright, thank you and bye bye. Alright, oh, welcome to the RAMSD AM1 upgrade. Like you're gonna see, is, uh, I have removed the last, I have removed the two last transistors and they are replaced with the 2N2219 like you can see and uh, we're gonna test the transmitter now also I have some uh, cooling for the transistor what I have done is I removed the Q4 and Q3 and uh, replace them with the uh, 2N2219 Alpha. So let's see what happens. Alright, back on 5066 medium wave. Putting on the power. Um, I hope you can see it. It's practically around uh, 200 uh, milliwatts on this moment so I have a little plus approximately around the 50 25 or 50 milliwatts on power on this uh, very short transmitter so I really don't know if I let the transistors in or if I remove them to the original but like you can see the power is a little bit more a little bit I hope you can tune in uh, a lot of lights here ah, to 150 watts 150 milliwatts turning it off on the oh, turning it back on no. it goes up to yeah, 200 milliwatts so a little a little profit from removing the two transistors in the last part of the transmitter so you get the Q3 and the Q4 removed and replaced with the 22219 and it gives a little bit more power to this uh, very nice transmitter All right. that's uh, for me it, that's the Ramsey 
electronics AM transmitter AM1. I hope you enjoyed the little video and uh, maybe got some inspiration to uh, make it yourself. It's not a really expensive kit, so it's easy to uh, adjust. It's easy to build. Uh, it's uh, a lot of fun to uh, try making a nice radio station around it. Alright, enjoy and until next time. Bye bye.